Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share with you guys the next entry that I have received into my September swap. This one comes from Zanthony Russell, who is Diva Z, here on YouTube. And, um, so yeah, I'm going to show you what, uh, she sent in. I'm, like, dropping stuff back there in the background. My apologies, y'all. Um, I'm not really with it. I have not made a video in a few days, almost a week. Um, this week was just, uh, complete catastrophic for me. Not really catastrophic, but I have been so extremely busy this week that I have not even had time to think straight, um, Football season is going to kill me, y'all. I know I keep saying that, but now that the oldest one's in high school football, like, my brain, I just can't. Like, I have so much stuff that has to be done all the time. Um, so, but we're getting, we're making it through. I mean, it's the beginning of October, um, and, uh, Halloween's almost, I mean, Halloween. Listen at me. I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, Football is nearly halfway over, so we're going to get through it, y'all. We're going to get through it. Okay. We have this first tag, and um, I don't know if you guys can see this cat, but it is so stinking cute. I absolutely adore it. I love the cupcake liner rosette she has on there, as well as the little... There's her... Um, this is her YouTube channel right here. Um, if you guys don't know who she is, you know me. I will have a link to her channel in the description bar below. Um, I love this um, this trim that she found. And I'm curious as to where she got it because I have not seen any orange trim like that. So you'll have to let me know, girl. Um, super, super cute. I love these pumpkins as well. And I love that cat. Super cute. So there's that one. Am I like too close to the camera? Did I get too close? If I did, there you go. I just wanted you guys to see that that cat is outlined. Um, super cute. Then we have this, this one here. And it says Happy Halloween on it. And I love the witch flying on her broom and I kind of like how it overlaps the edge a little bit and of course she's got these orange blings in there and this happy Halloween is that a die cut if so if that's a die cut and not a sticker I'm gonna need to know how you attach such small um dye, fine, you know, fine line dyes onto, what glue do you use is my question. And then she's got some, um, I think that's tool she's got, it's kind of, um, folded over so I can't really tell, but I think that's tool she's got as the string hanging off there, super cute. You did a good job on your tags. Oh look, she kind of halfed and halfed them. She made some Halloween and some fall. Ooh, super pretty. I love this um, stuff at the bottom here. Um, this like meshy ribbon. I know this came from the Dollar Tree because I got some. It was in the package of leaves. So it's kind of in the shape of a leaf, but it's also actually really like mesh. Where did you find this leaf sticker? That's super cute. I love that. I also like the little rosette she has in the background there. That that ribbon I know came from Dollar Tree because I have it. Super cute. So did this. Super cute. I love the um, paper that she used here in the background. I love paper that has words on it. I know it sounds weird, but I do. And it says Autumn Dreams Falling Leaves. Those are super, super cute. Good job on these girl this one's equally as cute I love how she used the buttons here and the maple leaves there and I don't know where she got these little stickers but I'm loving these little there's a pumpkin on this one too you see that they're kinda like foiled almost super cute 
I like the little ruffle she has down at the bottom. And this one says, fill this fall with lots of love and laughter. Yeah. Ooh, I like that gold foiled on the back too. And this is some of that ribbon that she used down here at the top. These are big, these are big tags, y'all. They like are bigger than my hand. I know that's not saying much. I know I have a small, chunky, fat hand, but I mean, they are a quite, quite a good size. I would measure it if I had my ruler, but I don't. So just take my word for it that they're huge, right? Um, and I love this one. I like how she's made the rosette and then the little, um, what I call metal ribbon design coming down from the bottom of that there. She's put on just a few sequins on the outside and she's layered it underneath some leaves there. Super, super pretty. I love that polka dot ribbon. And then also I like this sticker that she, this pop-up sticker that she has added. Um, if you, if you don't like on camera, that probably just looks like a little piece of like maybe a plaque or something, but I mean, I think it really is a sticker, but if you didn't know any better, I mean, that would look like, um, a piece of, uh, like a plaque or something like resin or something like that. Be grateful, super cute. And then I like how she has glittered the outside edge. Very nice. Very, very nice. Ooh, I like this one. What paper collection are you using? I've not, oh, maybe I do have this paper. I love, 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 love this. Um, did you, did this paper come like this or did you, um, you know, glitter the outside edge of that? That is so pretty the way that she just outlined just a couple little flowers on there. Super pretty. And it says all things, in all things give thanks. Um, and I believe that is from the Bible, uh, but I can't read that small. I need to get my eyes checked, y'all. That's a super cute piece. Where did you get this sticker? You'll have to let me know. I'm assuming that this one and that one, they must have all came together. Super pretty. I love, love, love it. And of course, she's added the leaves down here and then that meshy leaf in the background. You know, I seen and picked up several of these um, maple leaf ribbons because I thought they were so, so cute. And then I never seen them again. I kept a set for myself, which, by the way, is almost gone. And then I put the other set in the price packages for my challenge. So if I would have, if I would have known I wasn't going to see him again, um, I would have definitely have picked up more. And I like how she's used a pipe cleaner down here at the bottom as well. Super pretty. So those are her tags. Super cute. And then I'm going to, hmm, this one's taped. So I'm going to open this one without trying to tear it. And I'm hoping... I'm, I'm quite certain that they're about the same in there. And she's got all of these stapled. So, hint, hint, this is for me to open because she's taped it. I'm going to set these aside for just a sec. Ooh, I like that 31. Already the very first thing that comes out is 31. Is that it? I think so. Ooh, she shared one of these. Um, like I said, I need to know what kind of glue. I just love the detail and this um, Happy Halloween. I like that. This O here. This O. Girl, I can't even spell today. This A looks like a little ghost. And then we have the little bats off to the side. Super, super cute. But you'll have to let me know what kind of glue you use to put that down. Um, I find that, you know me, guys, my favorite glue is a Lean's Tacky Glue, and I don't think that that's going to work with that. Look at that little cat. He's super cute. All 
All right, now here's my next question. You can, I'm open in this one. Only because I know that that's the die cut. Forgive me, guys, but... <clears throat> um, my brain works in ways in which... Oh, it's not a foam piece. See, here, here I go thinking that this cat is a foam piece. But it's not. How stinking clever is that? This is why I have to take stuff and look at stuff. Because... I like to know how y'all put stuff together. Um, it helps me creatively to see how you done it. So what this is, this is not a foam piece, which is what it feels like. It feels like it's a foam piece, but it's not. What it is is she's got uh, pop-up dots on the bottom. She's got one of these cats on top of that. She's got another foam piece on top of that. And then she's got the another cat die on top of that. Hello. Good job on that. I would have never figured that out had I not opened it and seen it. Super cute. Ooh, look at this. This is cute. Yes, please. I got my broom and I got my cat. Then we have this skull. Super cute, right? And that's a pretty good sized one. We have a crow. We got a Halloween. And that's a, that's a foam sticker right there. We got this awesome spider. So cute. Then we have the 31, which I seen coming out. I really like this die. I need to find me. I don't have a ton of Halloween dies. I need to, I need to get me some. Um, and then we have that witch's hat right there. Super, super cute. So, those are Miss Diva Z's. Um, dies that she's included. Super awesome. Put that back in there. Ooh, look, there's a little bat too. I must have missed him. Super cute. So there's those. So everybody will be getting one of these little pumpkin envelopes full of her dies. I really like this trim. You're going to have to let me know where this trim came from because... Um, I think I need to be on the hunt for it. I'm going to put this one back in here. Alright guys, if you do not know who uh, Diva Z is, please go over and check her channel out. If you guys watch my channel, you guys know that she participates in just about everything that I do here on my channel. So you would have seen her work before. Let me get a good shot of one of these fall ones as well. Um, so one, one of you, five of you ladies will be getting one of these. Um, so if you don't know who she is and you haven't checked out her channel, please go over and do that. I will have her linked in the description bar below. If you like these kind of videos, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and as always, we'll see you in the next video. Bye!